Good afternoon and welcome to the Chartreuse Leprechaun. My name is Mark, your host, and welcome to episode four of Mr. Preppa, the beta version. Uh, as I said, in the, and I'm, I've got the game paused so we don't uh, use up our time and, uh, and health and so forth. Uh, but as I said in the last Mr. Prepper episode, beta testers are now approved to publish videos and walkthroughs of the beta version of Mr. Prepper. So the plan is doing Mr. Prepper videos for our Saturdays and Wednesdays, at least until release. Uh, we may also have some episodes on Friday or Monday, uh, kind of a, well, call it a bonus video, if you will. Uh, but that will depend on the release date for the full version, and that date has not been announced. So that will eventually decide how many episodes and how much material we are actually able to cover. I'm hoping to make it all the way through material before game release, but we'll see. And in the meantime, uh, please remember, as, uh, as I've said, this is beta version, so remember, what you are seeing is recorded during beta testing, and what you will experience in the actual game after you uh, after it is released will probably differ at least some, if not, well, at least some. <laughs> uh, also, for the record, I do expect and plan to get back to doing Leprechaun stories on Saturdays and Wednesdays. Uh, I'm just not sure when that's going to happen. Things keep popping up. There was the uh, health issues, and now there's uh, the opportunity to do the beta testing for this. Uh, yeah, we'll see. Uh, anyway, in our last episode, we started working our way around the mine, and we got the book on nuclear warfare from Bob at the mine and then sold it to the Minuteman, who now wants us to go find him a Geiger counter. Right. Uh, we also bought the cookbook from the Gourmet, which gave us a bunch more recipes. And the Gourmet will actually buy those from us if we cook them. Now, the truth is, you don't really need to make all of those, or any of those, really. Uh, between the mining and the cooking, you can already do. You can get enough health bonuses and raise enough money to make any purchases you need. Uh, but these new recipes, yeah, you can do it a lot faster. Uh, but for now. We need to focus on things around the bunker. Uh, for example, we need to build that silo that the Minuteman gave us the plans for. We also need some more power generation and to create an alternate water source and, well, a bunch of other relatively mundane things. You know, the kind of stuff that slows you down in every game one way or another because you got to go make this, gather that, and so forth. So uh, with that, let's just uh, let's get after it here. Uh, let's see where we're at. Uh, first things first, we need some food. Oops, there we go. And, hmm. Well, I guess we will eat a soup. Yeah, that fills us up. Okay. Well, let's, uh, get some water here. What? I'm carrying too much? What? Oh, I am. I've got all this stone. Oh, I've got some gold. I can sell some gold. Let's go sell Bob some gold. He will actually buy that from us. It's not worth a lot. It's only worth five, but hey, it's something. All right, so now let's uh, actually, let's stop and check our calendar. All right, so tomorrow is the inspector, and the day after that is power. Okay, thought I remembered that from our last video, but I wanted to double check myself. Let's go on downstairs and scrap the stone. And uh, yeah, there it goes. Okay, and we have some more. Ooh, uh, do we not have anything in the furnace? Really? Oh, we don't. Well, let's melt some metal here. That's good. And we have fire in there. The bottom is the amount of fire or heat you can generate. Uh, the top one is how I did figure it out is how uh, how far along in the process of the melting. So we're just kind of waiting for those. And there's our wonderful postman. The rumor is that Mr. Johnson woke up in someone else's bed last Saturday. He swears he didn't know how it happened. Mrs. Johnson's not having it. <laughs> All righty. There's our money. And we need... What do we got here? We have some cabbage, we have some beets, we have sunflowers, corn, orange, cucumber, and one carrot. So we could plant, hmm, we could plant four. 
That's tempting. Um, hmm. And we have four water. Let's do that, because we can definitely use the, uh, the vegetables here. So we'll plant that and water that. Yeah, you do not have to, by the way, plant in fives. Uh, it wants you to do it for a starter, and that's not a bad thing. Get that one, and get that one, and there we go. Now, it seems to me we still have some stuff back at the mine that we can get. Did we? I seem to recall having started the machines, and we'll uh, equip our gear here. Put that on. Very good. Close that and get there. We'll start at level three. Let's see what we have down there, if anything. I should have checked the video beforehand. Nope, that doesn't look like there's anything there. Yes? Oh, there is! More gold, another stone. Okay, that's good. Well, let's go back up to level two and check that. Oh yeah, that machine was running. It's actually still running. It's still got gasoline. Well, let's take a look here. Oh, iron, stone, gold, amethyst. Okay, we'll take all of that. This is good. 91. Yeah, well that fills us all the way up. So, I don't know. Let's check level one and see if there's anything there. Oh, by the way, if you hear any rumbling, uh, we're actually having a bit of a windstorm. I've done what I can to filter that out. Oh, it was running. Ooh. Yeah, I've done what I can to filter that out. Oh, no. I can't. Oh, we'll take that. Okay. And we can take the stone. And we're not going to get anything else, are we? Ah, uh, I don't know how much the gold weighs. Ooh. Uh, apparently, each one weighs two. Well, cool. Okay. Well, we'll take that. That is some good money that we can get from Bob. And we'll see if Sergey will take the stone. Or some of it, because we've now got way more than we need. We'll head home because we are full up. Uh, and we need to talk about Bob as a trading partner here real quick. You'll notice that Bob has a bunch of books. Uh, we need those books. Those are for lack of a better way to put it, skill upgrades. And, yeah, we can get that one, which is Builder Book, Extreme Shelter Makeover, Learn How to Build Rooms Faster. Okay, we'll go ahead and take that. We'll spend 20 to, ooh, didn't really want to do that, did I? Uh, okay, we can spend, we can do that. And we're going to need, uh... Let's see, we need more glass. Yeah, because we can melt for the metal, but we need the glass. So we'll go ahead and do that, which gets us... What else does he have to trade? Just wood. All right, well, we still need to come up with an alternate source of water, and we need more... Oh, that metal's done. Okay. Let's... uh. Put that 15 in there. That'll get us some more metal. And we need to take that helmet off, don't we? There we go. All righty. We'll head up here. And we will put all of our goodies in there. Outstanding. All right. So we've got four glass, eight metal, 22 stone, Plastics, a little bit of textiles, okay. Alright, so we need, we're going to need another generator before, actually we need like three of them. Three or four of them, uh, so that we have enough power to keep everything running while the, uh, when the power goes out day after tomorrow. So we kind of need to up our game and get more metal. Um, 
Ooh, there's our guy. And we'll take all of that and we'll read this. Now, when we read this skill book, it opens up this and it gives us the skill here. Uh, faster building of shelter rooms. So when we go to dig out the silo eventually, after we get the, the all the stuff we need for it, it's going to go faster. That's what that does for us. So, um, come down here. We're, we may not actually have to take a nap today. That's cool. Uh, we do, on the other hand, oh, wait a minute. It was over in this one. Yeah, we need another storage thing. So we're going to make a wardrobe. And I was wrong. We probably should have taken a nap. Look at that sleep meter. There we go. We got that. And we'll come downstairs. And we will put this here. Where's the ladder? Apparently it says we can put it in front of the ladder. What? Wait a minute. Let's zoom in and do this right. <laughs> All righty. So there's the ladder. There's the floor. Outstanding. We put that down. And now we'll put stuff in it, like our books. There we go. And that'll work. So let's come on up here. Get the water. And we'll come over here to this one. No. What do you mean, no? I thought we could make mushroom soup. Mushroom soup. There it is. Four mushrooms. Oh, the mushrooms in the sink. That's or in the fridge. That's right. Okay. There we go. Mushroom soup. We'll make some mushroom soup. That'll work. Okay. And then we'll come back over here and we'll cook that rat meat. We got three. We'll cook all three. That's good. And no, we don't have veggies to do any more cooking. Okay, well then we'll just go up and go to bed. Because it's that time. Okay, and today will be the inspection day. Okay, here we are. Let's get downstairs and find some food, which in this case will be, yeah, we'll go ahead and do a piece of rat. And why did it not cook the third one? That's interesting. Hmm, all right. Well, we are going to put all of our food in the fridge. We're going to put the water down here. Outstanding. We're going to take our traps. We're going to head to the forest and do some trapping as well as some berry harvesting. Cover that in case we don't get back before the inspector does. We should be okay, though. All right. Berries. There, ooh, wood. Very good. Very good. We're going to need a lot of that to build that silo. Grab that. And anything valuable down here? Yes, there is. We'll come get it. Get that wood, we'll get those berries, we'll come back here. We could go check the next couple of levels in the level one forest uh, section, maybe might be a better way to put that. Uh, here's what we're going to do. We are going to do some trapping right here. There's that one. There's that one. Outstanding. Very good. Now let's uh, see what we got going on here. Oh, we got some berries over here. Good, good. And we got some berries here. 
And that works. Oop, more there. Okay. Ooh, more there. And I think that's it. Yep, that's going to be it. Uh, what do we got? We have enough for two smoothies. Let's, uh, I don't remember if there's any berry plants or enough berry plants on this level to make it worth, well, there's one right there. Make it worth doing, and there's one right there. All right, just maybe there is. Uh, we appear to be on the far end of the... Get that one. And get that one. Where's the sign? Should be, oh, we didn't go far enough. All right. That will do for our berry harvesting. Yeah? Do what? I'm sorry, what? Okay, have fun. Okay, so here we are back at the house. Let's get into the kitchen. Make those smoothies. And that will get us, because uh, the smoothies are better for us, if I remember correctly, they are better for us in terms of... Uh, Oh, there's the inspector, right on cue. Glad we had it all covered. And we'll rush him through this whole thing. Should come up with nothing. Which he does. Oh, the phone is still missing. Yeah. We sold, we uh, disassembled the phone to make the mining helmet on a gamble. And the gamble was, there's another, uh, another vendor that opens up once you get uh, a couple of them to the right level. Now, unfortunately, we didn't make that in time, so the missing phone has raised our suspicion level. Uh, yeah. Not good, but we're okay. So, that apparently hurt our preparedness meter, so let's get back over here and have a bite to eat there. And we'll finish making our smoothies, because there was one we didn't get made. There we go. Now we'll put all three of those in the fridge. Outstanding. And we'll head upstairs and take a quick nap. While we wait for that to count down, because it should. Yep, there goes that meter, raising our... Uh, Taking care of our preparedness. There he is. Let's go down and get our stuff. Ooh, we got a letter. What do we get? Actually, we'll take all. And we'll read that. And it says, Just a quick note. My source in the agency tells me the water usage will be added to the things checked during an inspection. Excessive use may be noticed. Pay attention. This is why we need the alternate or additional source of water besides the sink, because the more things we grow, the more water we're going to need. And, yeah. So, we definitely need to do that. Uh, oops, the wood ran out in our generator. Well, let's, oh, yeah, still got the cover on this, so we can't just run downstairs. Take that off, okay. And we'll gather the metal, and we'll come back up here. And, ooh, tomorrow is an outage day, so we need more power. And we can only make one. Ooh. This may be a little close. We'll have to find out. Hmm. Interesting, interesting, interesting. So, there's a steam generator. Good, good. Let's disassemble some wood. that we picked up in the forest that we desperately need. And as I'm sure you recall, we need a lot of wood, metal, and glass. There's that one. And we need to put this one down right there. 
And there's that. So we got those on power. Ooh. So here's what's going to happen tomorrow when the power goes out. The house and the bunker is trying to run all the lights, the refrigerator, the stove, the lights down here, everything. So we kind of need to turn everything off so that their power only goes to the essential stuff like the refrigerator and the bunker because we're growing the plants. Oh, we need to put water on there, don't we? Almost forgot about that. There we go. Got those taken care of. Uh, yeah, got to turn that off too. We're just going to go through and turn everything off. Can't inspect that. Turn on. No, we don't want to do that. Turn that off. Hopefully that is enough that these two... Where's the other one? Wait, oh, I've got them right on top of each other? Oh, that was not good. All right, uh, but with that, we're going to go to bed and call this a day. The, uh, the inspector takes up a lot of time during the day, several hours for him to go through everything. So, yeah, you don't generally get a lot done. Uh, this kind of is what it is. So... It's a blackout. Oh, and we're hungry. So apparently we turned off pretty much everything that we need to to keep power going. So our plants are ready to harvest, actually. That's good. Uh, we need eat something. We'll eat that, and we'll eat one of those. And that gets us in good shape. Outstanding. We'll come down here. We'll get our vegetables. Outstanding. Ooh, and we picked up some seed as we harvested. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. Well, what did we get? Let's see here. We got one carrot, one beet, and two cabbage. So we basically got back what we put in. Well, that's cool. Okay, so... And I still have water, so we can get up here and make some more soup. That's... Oh, no, we can't either because I've got the stove turned off. ha, ha. How about that? Uh, and we don't have a lot of room in there, do we? So we will take the smoothies with us because we're about to do some traveling around. Here we go. Uh, actually. Uh, no, never mind. We'll leave that there. Okay, we'll come down here. And we'll put the water in there. We got five outstanding. And don't have any fuel for the. Hmm. I was thinking about the mine. Oh, we can go. We need to go check our traps. Let's go do that. Grab a few more berries along the way, because remember, berries replenish daily. And we'll get, oh wait, no, 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 shoot. Well, the good news is we can go back to that. Hey, and the traps have sprung. We got some venison. Okay, we'll grab that trap since it's empty and we'll come over here. We'll check this one and we got a chicken leg. Chicken leg. Okay, and we'll grab that. Outstanding. And anything good floating around up here? Yeah, a couple of berries. We'll grab those while we're here. Might as well, right? Grab that, and we'll grab this, and there we go. Grab that, and we'll go back to level one. Click on the forest, re-click on it, it takes us to level one. I think I talked about that a couple of episodes back. Um, 
Yeah, wood. There we go. Grab that. Absolutely want that wood. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead. We're going to do two excursions today. We're going to do this one through the forest. We're going to go through level one, gather berries, wood, uh, because we desperately need both. Anything up this way? Yep, piece of wood. Outstanding. Here we go. Oh my gosh, lots of berries here. Good, good. How are we doing on weight? Uh, 95. Oh, we're full. So much for gathering any more wood. What am I... F what? Two wood, two... What in the world has us so full? 20 pounds of berries. Two, one... That doesn't count for weight. Well, I think I mentioned in episode one that the weight allow the weight factors in this are really kind of messed up. Uh, a bat weighs more than a pickaxe. Uh, yeah, that kind of thing. Not good. Um, but kind of is what it is. Let's sell Jenny some. How many berries we got? We got twenty. We'll sell Jenny some berries. Just so we can generate some cash. And we'll go ahead and buy some seed, because that will bump her up on the level. There we go. Anything we can sell him? Nothing we want to sell him. Okay, we'll get some more glass. That'll work. And nothing we can sell her. Well, that's a bummer. All right, so let's head to the kitchen. Uh, we're still in a power outage. Disregard. I was going to... Oh, nuts. Hmm. Hmm. I was going to do some cooking, but if I turn that stove on, there's not... I don't think there's going to be enough power. Oh, there is. Oh, cool. Okay. Well, that's good news. Let's go ahead and make another smoothie. Alrighty. And... Don't want to roast the venison. Let's see what we can do over here. Pate, venison, three carrots, and a salt. Do we have salt yet? We don't. Ah. Mm, we do have carrots. Okay. What? Oh. All right. Do that. Oh my gosh. Three. And six. Uh, yeah. It thinks that the one pound of berries, uh, it takes six, six units of berries to make a smoothie. A unit of berry is one weight. So it thinks there's 18 weight in those three smoothies. Yeah, told you the weight factor was boogered. Uh, borked, whatever phrase you want to use there. Morning, we have a new series of stamps. Exciting, isn't it? It's, yep, you guessed it, our beloved president. Uh-huh. So let's gather up that. And let's just go on down and do disassembly work here. Start building up resources. Oh, yeah. We have some in here. There we go. Three metal. Ten of that. Okay, good, good. And disassemble that. Then we'll disassemble the lights. Outstanding. So, let's see. If I remember correctly, we needed ten glass, twenty metal, and forty wood. So we're Roughly about halfway to where we need to be to make our wonderful little, oh, 50 wood. I was close. Uh, our silo. Ultimate phase. Ultimate rocket plan. Phase one. Yeah. All right. So, salt. Seems to me, didn't we got some salt somewhere along the way, didn't we? No, apparently we never did. All right. Well, in that case, what we're going to do, put that down there. 
Well, oh, we can disassemble that baseball bat. That's pretty good. Uh, the food. We need to put that in the fridge, but we can't because there's no room. Um, hmm. That's a problem. Uh, we'll have to be careful with it, but we can, for now, put it down there. And, oh, 1900 hours. Uh oh. This is not good. Um, all right, we'll come back up here. Gotta get some salt. Oh, the gourmet has it. Let's go ahead and buy some. That'll get us there. Okay. Let's uh, take a nap since our sleep meter is down. Rain. Ah, uh, that was the thing we haven't done. We didn't make a bucket. Ah, uh, darn it. Actually... Can we do that? Do we have what we need? Uh, where is that one? Yeah, there it is. Let's make a bucket. Actually, let's make two buckets. Oh, this is going to put us past midnight, so we're going to have to be careful. And we'll take the salt. Okay, and what do you do with the buckets? You should come put them in the backyard, strangely enough. Where are the buckets? There they are. There's one. I'm going to put it there. I'm going to take the other one and we'll put it there. Now, the fun part is, once you get a water tank in the, uh, in the house, then it will take those, we'll take those, and we'll take that. There we go, and we'll cook, and we'll come over here, and yep, we can make the pate, good deal, we'll make that. Oh goodness, this is taking too long. Alright, that takes care of that. Let's see if we've got enough room for everything now. I don't think we do. One, two, three, four, we don't. Darn it. Um... Hmm. All right. Well, it'll have to do because we are out of time. We got to get upstairs and get to bed. Hopefully, nothing spoils. Mm -hmm. Good news is the power comes mm -hmm. back on today. So, all right. So he's hungry. So we should probably get him downstairs to eat. And. We will have smoothies. Actually, no. We are going to eat that. Eat all of those. And then we'll have our soup. There we go. Which brings us all the way up. We can put the mushrooms back in there. And beets, carrots. We can make soup. Should be able to make soup. Let's go here. Anything else we can make? No. Anything else we can make over here? No, 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 no. Okay, we'll go back here and we'll make some vegetable soup. Ooh, we can make two of those. Outstanding. And that, that helps a lot. Okay, now we're doing, now we're doing. There we go, we got that. We put, yeah, oh no, wait, what? Uh-oh, hmm. We're still back to space problems. Um, I'm going to take the mushrooms out. We'll put the vegetables in. Yeah, that works. Let's go see what we can sell here. Does he want anything? He wants kimchi, which takes two cabbage, one water, one salt, one glass. Really? I think we have the cabbage, and we have water, we have salt, and we have glass. You know what? I think we're going to make some kimchi. Separate that out. That's a tedious part to this, and I don't like it, but here's what it is. There's that. Let's get back up here. We get the salt. We get the cabbage. I think it was, it was two cabbage, right? I think. 
kimchi should light up. Yes, it does. There we go. We can make a kimchi, which we can then sell. And now you see where the money part of this comes into play. There we go. We make 20 off of that, which is good. And we need a nap. Let's get upstairs. Take a quick nap while we wait on the postman. And we'll speed that up with the left control button. And... And there we go. We'll get down here. There we go. Used to be more lively here in the neighborhood. Yeah, neighborhoods do that. And we, there's our money. Good deal. So let's see. Don't think there's anything we need from him. However, oh, we need to build our trust level there. Nothing we can do there. She doesn't want anything we have, and he doesn't want anything we have. Well, that's a bummer. Uh, anything we need here? No. All right. Uh, oh, one of the things you want to watch out for as you play the game there's a the uh, among the books you can buy from Bob is uh, price negotiation books. And when you do that, uh, you get to to work the difference. Uh, you'll buy it for 10, you'll sell it for 20 type of thing. Uh, so keep your eyes open for that. In the meantime, we need that. And we need some more metal. And that's going to be about all we're going to get out of that. Now, seems to me we had stuff in the mine still to collect. So take a look at that. Oh, by the way, the third level of the mine, you can mine salt. Uh, so uh, you never really run out of salt. Uh, Matter of fact, let's just go down there because I don't think we've grabbed the. Uh, I don't think we've mined. Oh wait, disregard. We need to go back up because we have stuff in those uh, mining machines. This one, I believe, was still running. Yep, still has stuff. More metal, good. And we'll head to level two. And, yeah, it is finally winding down. Ooh, emeralds. Okay, we're going to get some serious money out of this. 92, so we're full up. All right, that was worth it. Uh, back to the entrance. That was definitely worth it. Uh, I don't recall anything still being in the mining machine down on level 3, so that's good. Um... Let's go back to the house. Lovely weather. Yes, indeed. What do we got? Uh, oh, we don't have the room to pick any of that. Oh, wait. And I can't trade. Oh, fun. All right. Uh, we can't trade until we build some room in our inventory like that. There we go. Put that iron ore in there. Get that going. Now we can take all of that. Now we can come back over to see Bob and sell him those precious minerals. Fifteen for that. We got one. Come on, emerald. Sixty-five. Not enough for a book. Well, that's a bummer. All right. Oh, yeah. And there's uh, there's also rubies and there's diamonds. So, uh, yeah, it's definitely worth taking some gasoline and throwing it in there. Unfortunately, it's a limited supply in the mine. You've got to get Bob's trust to get another vendor who actually sells gasoline and a few other things that we're going to need along the way. So definitely something to... Oh, that's good. Look at all that water. And those are full. That is outstanding. We just don't have a... Uh, oh, the water tank. Yeah. Uh, eventually, you build up enough trust level with Sergey that he will have a water tank for sale. And then those those buckets in the yard, they automatically fill that water tank, which is huge. Uh, a couple of versions ago, you had to have a couple of water tanks because they only held like 
20 water. Uh, now they hold like five water per slot, so they're like a hundred. Uh, I have yet to be able to use it all up. Um, uh, yeah. So let's see about anything to disassemble. What do you mean there's one left? Huh. I didn't sell that one? Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm going to get there in time. I'm not. Darn it. Nope, didn't get there in time. Well, bummer. All right, well, another 15. That won't hurt anything. Uh, let's come back over to Sergei. And... No. And how are we doing on bait? We need to... Seems to me we have one down below. So we need one to do another round. All right, we'll do three, just because... That'll give us two more rounds of trapping. Uh, eats. And nothing there. Gourmet. He wants more kimchi, but we don't have any more cabbage. Well, that was cabbage seed, wasn't it? No, that was beet seed. Corn seed, cucumber seed. All right. Uh, a couple of things you can do. That We talked about it, I think, last episode. There's a, a thing we can make called a dryer. Uh, if you grow corn and dry it, you get flour. If you grow beets and dry it, you get sugar. Uh, cucumbers, of course, you know, make pickles and, and so on. So, uh, pretty cool. Uh, we're just kind of waiting on, well, that's going to be a little bit. Actually, we should put that away, shouldn't we? There we go. Um, hmm, how are we doing here? Oh, we need to, do we have wood on us? We don't. Well, let's go get some. Grab that. We'll come over here. Yep. And there we go. Now we'll come back up here. We'll grab the money and the stuff. Very good. 78. Do we have another book we could get from Bob at 70? We do not. Have to have 100. Oh, well. Um... Dump off our resources, we'll disassemble, and we'll call that a night. Uh, there we go, we go to sleep, and we get another day in the books. And there we go. So he's hungry. Oh, we got another newspaper. Uh, he's hungry, so we'll need to take care of that. But I think we're going to do that in our next episode. Uh, we're going to call this an episode. Uh, yeah, yeah, I think that's enough for today. So I want to thank you for your time today. Your time is valuable. You chose to spend it with us here at the Chartreuse Leprechaun, and we are very grateful. We'd love to hear from you, so leave us a comment. Let us know what you like, what you don't like, what you think, what you don't think, uh, what you'd like to see. Uh, we want to get better, and we want to do it for you. So, uh, And also, please subscribe. Set yourself up for notifications and all of that so you don't miss anything around here. And uh, as always, just remember, if you see it and you can't quite explain it, you can be pretty sure the leprechaun did it. And with that, I will let you go. You have a great day, a great week. And we will see you here next time on the Chartreuse Leprechaun. Bye-bye. Did I go the wrong way? I did. Oh, that's fun. I just went 900 meters in the wrong direction. That was where we wanted to go. Well, fantastic.